Good evening and welcome to Christians Aren't Sheep, a beginner's guide to meditation. My name is Ron, I'm the host of the show. And this is a channel you don't need to subscribe to. You don't have to hit the like button. And I won't ask you for any money. But it is a good place to hang out if you want to do a little devotional time, give you something to think about meditating on. Just kind of unwinding a little bit. Uh, today is Thursday. So I've been <clears throat> fasting Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday. So tomorrow will be a weigh-in day. We'll see how I'm doing. Hopefully getting a little closer to 220. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. So, devotional for tonight is taken from Matthew chapter 7. Building on a solid foundation. Anyone who listens to my teaching and follows it is wise like a person who builds a house on solid rock. Though the rain comes in torrents and the flood waters rise and the winds beat against that house, it won't collapse because it is built on bedrock. But anyone who hears my teaching and doesn't obey it is foolish, like a person who builds a house on sand. When the rains and the floods come and the winds beat against that house, it will collapse with a mighty crash. Foundations. Super, super important. So on tonight's reading for January 4th, uh, excuse me, is entitled Resilient Faith. Towering dunes along the north shore of Silver Lake put nearby homes at risk of sinking into the shifting sands. Though residents tried moving mounds of sand in efforts to protect their homes, they watched helplessly as well-built houses were buried right right before their eyes. As a local sheriff oversaw the cleanup of a recently destroyed cottage, he affirmed the process couldn't be prevented, no matter how hard homeowners tried to avoid the dangers of these unsteady embankments. The dunes simply couldn't provide a strong foundational support. Jesus knew the futility of building a house on sand after warning the disciples to be very to be wary of false prophets he assured them that loving obedience demonstrates wisdom he said that everyone who hears his words and puts them into practice is like a wise man who built his house on the rock the one who hears god's words and chooses not to put them into practice however, is like a foolish man who built his house on sand. When circumstances feel like shifting sands, burying us under the weight of affliction or worries, we can place our hope in Christ, our rock. He will help us develop resilient faith built on the unshakable foundation of his unchanging character. Hmm. A little prayer that goes along with this reading is, Jesus, please help me develop resilient faith. Empower me to demonstrate my trust through loving obedience to you. Amen. Amen. And <laughs> this is just a little footnote. But 
Let you out. The word and a new year. We read that a couple of days ago. <laughs> and uh, I remember saying at the end of this, what grace-filled words can we speak this year? The very next day, me and my wife and my daughter were playing Chinese checkers. And my wife was just messing me up every every time she moved. No, not Chinese checkers. Dominoes. Every time she put a piece up, it would mess me up. And I said some bad words. <laughs> so, I don't know. It's... Uh, Something you have to work at all the time. Well, that's all for tonight. God willing, we'll see you tomorrow. Good night.